this short video, we'll explain how we can add a printable part to a very specific shape, in this case, a shoe. Using ESCO Studio Tools, we will be able to define this printable area and distort graphics on this surface. Let's see how we do that. Starting from an OBG file, we can go ahead and download the open source 3D application Blender and import this OBG file into our Blender application. Once we select it, the OBG file, we can go ahead and import it and export it to a Collada file. Now this Collada file will not have a printable area defined on it. So if we would place this in Adobe Illustrator, Illustrator together with Studio wouldn't know what the printable area is. In order to define this printable area, we have a variety of different ways. In this proof of concept, we're showing you how you can insert code into the DAE file. Here, we're opening this file using BBEdit, a text editing program. And in this file, we are looking for the library material. identifying the material, head on over to esco.com support and find an answer for preparing shapes right there. And here you will find the XML code that needs to be inserted in that Collada file. This document shows you which place you need to insert this. And right here, the technique profile name we will change. Go ahead and change the horizontal and vertical print size to encompass the entire object. And then copy the material ID from the library material tag into the printable front material and paste. We'll call this print area one. Let's go ahead and save this and add the word convert it to this file. So now when we start a new document and we place this converted DAE file, You will see with our ESCO Studio tools that we have our printable area. When we select the shoe, we will see this printable area and overlaying a pattern, you will now be able to visualize the distortions required to print on this substrate. Now, keep in mind that you can also accomplish this in a much easier fashion using the ESCO Studio Toolkit and brush the printable area onto the surface.